Okay, so today um, we're going to do Newton's second law lab. And the way it looks is it's going to be um, a cart set up on a track on top of the table. This is not a precise drawing. It's just to give you an idea what's going on. So you have this cart that is 500 grams. You have a hanging mass, which is 50 grams. And then you have 200 grams placed on top. Okay, these things are connected um, by a string and they're hanging over a pulley. This is let go, which means that this force, the force pulling this down, what force is pulling that down? Wait, so let's, let's talk about, some of you guys said gravity. Gravity, the force gravity is also called weight. Okay, so again, I'm gonna call that W. Um, Dr. Bata is going to call that F sub G, the force of gravity. It's okay. They are the same thing. Okay. What you need to know is that force is equivalent to mass times gravity, the acceleration due to gravity. Notice that this is not a G. It is a subscript G. This is mass times G. This is force sub gravity. All right. There is a difference. <clears throat> But that's not the only force acting on this 50 gram mass. You also have the tension, okay? But overall, what is causing this system to move? This. So this is what you call the applied force in this lab. All right, so your applied force. As part of your pre-lab, you're going to go ahead and go into the lab and you're gonna calculate all your applied force values for trials one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, 